I think what's really interesting, though, is that the Gulf carriers are now fundamentally threatening that long-haul, profitable business model. The Gulf carriers are terrific. Uh, you know they're terrific and they're doing a good job because Lufthansa and Air France is now lobbying actively to prevent them you know, continuing to grow and expand in Europe. And if Lufthansa and Air France are lobbying against it, it must be good for consumers. Um, so they should be encouraged. I mean, look at it, they're keeping Alitalia and Air Berlin and a lot of other uh, cripples alive, which is very good for my business in the medium term anyway. The last thing I want to see is uh, Alitalia go bust. I want to see Alitalia gradually decline over a 20-year period where some fool pays a check of three or 400 million a year to keep them alive and then commissions Giorgio Armani to redesign the uniforms like Alitalia's uniforms have been the problem for the last 40 years. But what the Gulf carriers are doing now is fundamentally re-engineering uh, the long haul, the assumptions of the legacy carriers. They can no longer look forward to a long haul monopoly. They can no longer look forward to screwing people for ludicrously excessive airfares on long haul for the next 10 years.